Hello! Class here, Half Minute Hero 2. In the last part, everyone in this village died except this guy, because he was off to the Tower of Contracts, hoping to grow strong. We can't open the gate on our own, so we should just head forward to this quest and be like, oh? Looks like there's a temple that may belong to the Venus 7. It'd be awfully easy to get there. Oh, it's presents! Welcome. You're the first slaughter daughter. Bring her to death. Don't know if you're a hero or a celebrity or whatever, but. You don't want to taste my power. POW! And then we take 4,200 something damage and die. <laughs> and then the quest begins. Okay, Yuja. Your vital signs are temporarily at zero. Did something happen? I was heading towards some weird flower garden, started to rage and throw a tantrum, and now I'm back. I'd rather not do that again. Song of Destruction invoked. I'm gonna take care of you in the village, and Ku's gonna give a song, but listen carefully because you're singing with all our heart. Okay, let's proceed. It's gonna be tough to fight a Venus 7 member who has command over power death. Maybe some clue can be found in the village. Yeah, it's the guy from before. You're strong, aren't you? Please take care of the enemy. If you want your enemy killed, you should do it yourself. And he's not strong or anything. It's all about attitude and work to grow stronger. I hate when people depend on others. Get revenge. Angel or demon, he'll sell his soul for strength. And yeah, if all goes well, you'll no longer have to depend on the power of others. Okay, gonna go to the Tower of Contracts in the north. It's, we have the key. If you climb to the top, you can meet an angel. If you go to the bottom, a demon. You can meet either. It's just that it's not as easy to get a contract as it sounds. Venus 7 attack the village, maybe there's something that will help us deal with the attack. Oh, can't take stuff and leave. So let's see, when I did this on my own file, I went the demon route, and then I later did the angel route. But uh, here I'm just gonna do the angel route. Or maybe I'll... Yeah. I don't know if I have time and stuff to... Yeah, I'll, I'll head down first. I, I might be able to fulfill both objectives and then just take the Angel contract. Please excuse me. Perhaps I'm being mistaken, but are you here to enter a contract? Yeah, that's right. Very good news, glad you came. I'm a demon, but I'm a bit of a pickle. Gotta help with the problem, and then I'll enter in a contract. The Necronomicon was recently stolen. It would, it would be trouble if word got out. The thief is still in the basement. Got, gotta get the Necronomicon. And yeah, he'll be waiting on the fourth basement floor. Where don't my time go? <laughs> I guess I fought a lot of enemies on the top floor. Alright. What do you have to say? Phantom Thief Lubim is your target. There's nothing he can't steal. He's still raiding the area. He'll appear and disappear at intervals. And his ability to escape is unrivaled. Got him. Obtain the Necronomicon. No way! See ya! And then we go up. Because if I went down, I would just get the demon contract. Oh yeah, I want time, not health. Okay. What adorable visitors. It's been a while since humans last climbed the tower, and it's an angel. Please enter a contract. Well, you are free and available, but you're not going to do it for just anyone. Got a... Okay, from the second floor to the fifth floor of this tower, there are red monsters and blue monsters. And the balance is important. Red and blue is not in harmony lately. Gotta make the number equal. Okay. Gotta achieve perfect balance and then visit the fifth floor. Okay. If you think balance can be achieved by defeating all of them, that's a no-no. Alright. I don't see any red or blue on this floor. Well, I mean, I see red, I guess. But I think this is just the first floor. So it starts here. That's one blue. One blue, the rest red. Okay. Current balance is eight red and six blue. Okay.
I thought it was measured on a per floor basis. Oh wait, we just went down, didn't we? Gotta go up here. Okay, I've achieved the loveliest level of balance. Had a tough time for it, so sorry. We now have a contract. Don't know the new master's name, you're Oron, it's a pleasure. Now we can fight the Slaughter Daughter, let's get going. Okay, your powers are those of restoration. There was a chest up there, how dare you make me descend the whole tower. Oh, ain't got no business here. Alright then. Perhaps you can get there from the demon route, or... Going all the wrong ways. Yeah, we can defeat whatever and it doesn't matter at this point. You don't mess up the balance anymore. Okay, there's the chest. Got the power staff. Got both weapons, the Necronomicon and the power staff. Oh, maybe I should have stopped at that goddess statue. So we're looking to get down, not up. Okay, now let's go. Came back. We're sure persistent. This is the power of the agreement. No way! This child, did he make an agreement with the angel or demon? Uh, the answer is yes. Introduction to death. And we take 300 damage! You, you, guh. <laughs> All right, quest clear. Well done. Done all there is to do on the continent. Let's head to the next one. But I will make it through somehow. Hey, it didn't disappear. Just an empty shell. It's a contract tower. Oh. Oh. It appears that defeating the Venus Seven earlier resulted in time stream being returned to the villagers. Okay, yeah, Oron's father says he's safe, finally managed to contract. The time's finally come. Okay, I'm sure you yourself are under the impression you'd never get a contract, but even throughout the long family history, you're the one who has the most incredible of power that has yet to awaken. I thought it would be best if those powers never awaken, but... Its awakening has coincided with the visit of the adventurers. It's true the world is facing incredible hardship, and so Oron is going. Well, I see the world and make better use of the powers. Your name is Yuja, right? Please take good care of the sun. Boy's already a fine young man, and he's gonna work hard to help us. Alright, let's head to the next continent. I wonder if I had to come back and do that. They might have refused to set sail before that. Okay, our next battle awaits up ahead. Landed. But there are Venus 7 here, too. Bound to win, though. Let's see. Oh, this one. This one's. Well, kind of fun. Robot. Cool. There's a racetrack up ahead. Okay, Circuit Heaven. Okay, been waiting for Yuja, third slaughter daughter, one of these seven team member in charge of throwdowns. We're about to be running like the wind. Don't need no sanctuaries or song of destruction. However, the time limit's 30 seconds. Gonna compete in a death race. Prepare to buggy with a crunchy growl. Runs like a dream. No excuse for lose. Get ready. You're gonna win this by a mile. Okay, another oddball here, Yuja. This time... Oh, hey, number 30 is gone. It's the Dark Goddess. Okay, I heard that something interesting would happen. It'll serve as the official race queen. Not exactly dressed for the part, but enough talk, let's do this. First to arrive at the goal is the winner. The buggy's plenty fast, but it can dash as well. No fighting along the way, hitting the Slaughter Daughter will put you in a world of hurt. And the race time limit is 30 seconds, so maybe people, you can talk. Go! Okay, you want the people in charge. They're cannons, you can move faster. Your HP or time are running low, gotta veer off course and get some time stream. There are landmines hidden enough and the buggy will be ruined and can supply us with a new one. There are times when we can reach the goal faster as is. Good luck. Oops. 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 
Hit too many landmines. That was not on purpose. Nothing to do but run. Pow! Yeah, this race is pretty easy. Oh, oh wait, I thought that was a mistake for a moment. Because I thought it was pointed down. Okay, goal! Winner is Yuja. Entire fortune is gone. You're ruined. Better living expenses on a race. Okay, he lost. Our racing was on a totally different level. Got, I gotta meet next time, and he's like, there won't be a next time. We're gonna finish you off. And she's like, no, uh, no, please no. Okay, and she's been neglecting her fighting abilities. I mean, you already won. Why is the battle even necessary? Did I maybe mess with someone I shouldn't have? And we're like, pow! One hit. Okay, wanted to run like the wind. Slaughter daughter forever. Quest clear. I know there was treasure and stuff on that. That was pretty cold-blooded, if you ask me. She was a bit of a sore loser, but she wasn't the worst person. Okay, and those who defy Yuja get what they deserve, and... Hey, hey, Yuja. Oh, she's still alive. What incredible willpower. You're the first person I've met who was willing to really hit me with like that, Yuja. Okay, what's going on? Feels if I've been reborn, I'll leave my team and move on from the Dark Time Goddess, and want you to take me with you. I have no idea what's going on, but come with us. With that, it's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Okay, I already defeated eight of them. And the next is the seventh and final one. Prepare ourselves, adventure's just beginning. I commit all the bravery that I have. Let's see, who's out of the team? Actually, who's in the team? <laughs> River Fee is not a Okay, it's... Wait, I don't actually see where Rurufi is. Back middle? Francesca takes up a lot of space. Oh yeah, Sach. Sach, or whatever is her actual name. She's got a lot of attack power, so that's why I like her. Angel Aura. Uh, maybe take out Rurufi, actually. Oh, was that the top position? Oh, whoops, I had the position selected. Okay. There we go. Eh, I don't feel like looking over the racetrack for medals. Oh yeah, the end part's shaped like a music note, for reasons. <sighs> Melody of Destruction. Okay, you are all that remains of the once great Venus 7. You're Sakuron, the living incarnation of terrible sounds. Your music is accursed sounds, you can spread curses, you got a special stage. I remember one of the goals, or the titles, took me a long time to figure out here. I don't remember what it was, but it took a long time to figure out. She has command over sound, and Ku's song will never falter. This isn't a competition, but what could be worse than hearing accursed music from a stage? Music is something people should enjoy, so let's smash the Venus 7. Okay. Number 30 will explain the situation. The temple's there. There's a special stage. Okay. You've got to analyze the music. The result of the analysis will be available soon, so you're at the village. One. Go! Analysis complete. Okay. Cursed music notes all over the land. Tormenting people. But ramming attacks are effective against the music notes. Gotta ram the notes. Rapidly strike notes. Failing to hit a note will cause them to rain down upon you. Curses will reduce your level and money, so be careful. Go to the east, at the stage. Okay. Pow! Start with a trial. Okay, number three will be helping. Gotta strike at least one note. Nice! Okay, that should be enough for the trial. And Kuzu's like, how can you call that music? And Sakuran's like, there must be something wrong with your ears. But no, there's something wrong with your eyes. Which is still awesome. Alright, next stage. Three times the size can go up or down. 
Okay, I got to hit at least five. So yeah, no timing or anything is involved. You just got it. Hit the notes. Oop, I missed one. Yeah. Oh, I died! Because I used all my HP dashing, and then when the note hit the end, it did damage. Because that's one of the possible effects of the music notes. <laughs> yeah, I didn't fail because I missed one, I failed because I died. Yeah, I get it. Did I miss one? I heard a sound effect, like maybe I did. Yeah, maybe not. Maybe it just makes that sound periodically. Cool beans. We're able to clear that stage. She'll have to beat us down personally. Okay. Sounds like coup or something. I don't know, I wasn't paying attention to the text. Yeah, since I failed one, the special final challenge isn't open to me. You can get, like, an equipment if you do that one. I don't care enough. It's not something I did my first time through the game until the post-game. I think we're great on evil, so let's just go. Musical showdown, just a little delay in the schedule, battle, and we're really strong. An angel ring apparently restores health, so I like it. Angel Oron is the best Oron. Okay, so you've got a skill that takes a while. POW! Did that just like instantly destroy all my allies? Just like I thought, bad music is destined to be forgotten. Quest clear. Congratulations. You definitely get a title if you clear that last stage that I didn't have access to. I think you might even need the, all the notes perfectly, not just not fail. But anyway, I already managed to defeat all the Venus 7. Yep, managed to survive again. Venus 7, you worked so hard to assemble a thing of the past, but don't worry, you made good use of your time and created the greatest special stage of all. We're cordially invited. And where are you taking us? It's another continent. Not again. Anyone else would have died five times by now. Well, where are we? Well, first we gotta acknowledge that the previous quest ended. The arrangement of the tones takes away my sadness. Alright, looking back, I fought a lot of different enemies up to this point. The gods, the God 9, the Venus 7. Uh, okay, the time? Or what this time and where? Okay, you should expect our next foe to be the Dark Goddess herself. It's more difficult than ever to predict what may happen. Be especially careful. Final battle. Except I don't think it is. Buy something, okay? Well, not right now. Actually, wait. Let's get an herb now. Wow, that's a lot of red enemies. Big Venus, quest 68. Okay. Da, 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 da. Something like that. Okay, it's amazing. Wanted a hero castle of your own, so you made one for yourself. It's the Big Venus. Okay, robot will be taxed, tasked with spreading adorable statues around the world. But all humans will be turned into goddess statues and you'll collect money. Okay, and Yuja will also turn into goddess statue in 30 seconds. I'm not sure who's going to be paying money to the statues when everyone is a statue, but, um... We're going to need the hero castle. However... The road to the hero castle is being blocked. Okay, I need the hero castle to defeat Big Venus, but you need to defeat Big Venus to get the hero castle. That's a throw 33! Okay, gotta move Big Venus. Gotta sneak into Big Venus itself. But the entrance is high up and inaccessible. Okay. Perhaps one of the villagers knows a way to reach the robot entrance. Something strange is happening to the villages. Advise hurrying to villages. I think there's only one village here, so I'm not sure why that's pluralized. Oh no, there's a tent. That's kind of like a village. <laughs> Use the herb to win the battle. Wow, there's so many goddess statues. Yeah, all the villagers have been turned. Can't gather any information and do anything. It's incomplete, maybe I'll to return them to normal by paying them money. How <laughs> does that make sense? 
Okay, so this one's 25G. You're saved! The guy in Northern Village that likes high places. You're saved too, it's time to wake up. Well informed scholar in the north. You're saved for a hundred. Your salad's still okay. Okay, and you're saved too. Now you can reopen the shop. Yeah, hey, I'm not gonna do a goddess loan. Because <laughs> the interest is like measured in percentage per second. It's ridiculous. And you aren't allowed to pay it back until the end of the quest. Alright. Hey, hey, he's on a business trip and can let us change Hero Castle parts. You're saved! You're saved, you're a parts vendor. You can get energy legs, except it said power legs. Now to actually get a reset. Let's see, Northern Village. You're gonna change that person back. I felt if you were equipped with the goddess statue. It's an aura suit, it's dragon lance, I like dragon lances. Okay, you thought you'd be stuck forever, and you're gonna give us your trusted toys, and now we can see all the scenery. Okay, and that's what it's like to be inside a goddess statue. If you ride something with enough height, you may be able to enter. Incredibly tight fit, thank you. We're the villager's hero, and we're on stilts! We got the toy from the guy that gave us the toy. Bamboo stilts. And now we can feel taller. And board Big Venus. And crush more monsters, because I want the aura suit. These monsters are actually worth a lot of money. I'm feeling like it might be a good idea to go around just a little more. Alright, second reset, and we're in the Big Venus. Okay, let's move it out of the way. Let's do this. So that's what it's like inside. Quickly growing tired of all the goddess statues. Gonna be able to get past them. Just make inside, so yeah, I'll let number 30 know if we need them. They are normal and abnormal statues. Try examining them. The ones with the gold on top, you can check them. There's a slot to insert money. That one costs 200G, but we've got no choice. Welcome. 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 Got the gold rush hammer. There's a steering wheel. Steering wheel. The driver girl is like, wow, you're here already? The Dark Goddess made the steering wheel for us to use. Figured no one would find it here. That's why you're called God on Air. The name like Big Venus shouldn't move without a steering wheel. Doesn't really move all around all that much, I think was the next word, but forget it. Now Big Venus will move. Who do you think you are driving around the Big Venus? I'll show you by moving it myself. Then why didn't you do that? Start with it. Now I gotta go outside and strike Big Venus with the castle. I think I need more time. <laughs> Don't want timer to end during the fight. Also gonna level up the hero castle a little by crushing some monsters. You just moved it without paying, am I wrong? Don't think you'll get away with this destroy you and your stupid castle. I didn't actually equip the castle parts after I bought them, did I? It's fine though. Okay. Defeated. No. <sighs> Quest clear. How could you break my big Venus like that? You'll pay for this. It's expensive. Got a few tricks up my sleeve. At least you won't be so lucky next time. If you think you can reach me? Go ahead and try. If you've done it, Yuja. We destroyed Big Venus. According to my initial analysis, we had a three percent success. If you're tasking me that you need to be new and impossible, and like all's well that ends well, the Dark Goddess escaped. And make us jump through even more hoops to reach her. With her powers, she can destroy the world whenever she pleases, right? I'm sure that her transformation into the Dark Goddess destroyed her personality, but the Dark Goddess remains or, you know, remains the desire for the world use stability possible. The goddess's personality remains within, maybe merely toying with us, but also desires to stop herself. And yeah, number 30 can empathize pretty well. Okay, everything will be okay if we defeat her. Let's go with that for now. Right. Let's see, I 
don't want to start the next quest. Um, perhaps I can head back to the Battle Coliseum now that I've got several equipments and... Did I get a global level? I don't know if I have since then. What are the stats on my stuff anyway? Unbelievably strong and unbelievably heavy hammer. That is a pretty strong hammer. <laughs> Yeah, with this weapon... Also, the aura suit's probably pretty good. Yeah, I like our chances at the Coliseum. Let's, let's go back there. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna participate. Jink! I don't have a nerve this time. We're also significantly stronger. Okay. Final round. Previous winner, Yuja versus... Oh yeah, that guy. Oh, nice. The heals. Totally overpowered. Defeated him. Victory! It's done it yet again. Victory to Yuja. And we get a silver salad. And the bunny girl likes strong people. Okay, now that we have two victories, we have another reward. The right to fight at the Underground Coliseum. Feel free to participate in their tournaments. Let's see. Oh, yeah, might as well go in. So there's a whole global dungeon under here. We needed... or wait. No, there's gotta be. Lord Mail, Angel Diary 4. Nice. No, there's... Where's the underground coliseum? Oh yeah, it's it's at um um it's not there. It's not here either. Um, I'm like two villages short or something. No, here near Contracti Village, unrivaled championship of the world. This is where the underground coliseum is, but uh, these monsters are red to me. Yeah. I don't think we're going for a victory in that Coliseum yet. Coliseum next to Casino. I forgot there was a Casino here. This one has bigger slot machines. This one takes 25 Goddess Coins to use. And there's a Blade Suit and a Balmung. Level Upper X, it gives you a level up. Level Downer X, it gives you a level down. There are castle parts. Oh yeah, let's customize the castle. Well, and let's warp to our most recent location. Okay, claim this. Managed to gather a beautiful title. There are a lot of them. Now we can craft even more weapons. Oh, hey. Let's craft stuff. And then let's probably notice that it's not as good as the hammer. Where's hammers? There it is. Yeah, the gold rush is better. Although it weighs a lot. Maybe that's bad. Oh, hey, we have a, a, a bunch of titles. We get a formation. Beast King. Okay. It's nice to meet us. Don't have that yet. Okay. Cole wants to get violent. Okay. So, let's see. Is there anything else? Oh yeah, the castle part! Um... Actually, can I expand the castle before I go replacing any of these parts? I can. Now I can install four parts above the legs, and now it's impossible to go higher. Oops. I don't want to drive it. All right, and on this empty slot, I place... What did I just buy? Spike castle, maybe? Or was it legs? It was the power legs. I remember because I joked that they were called energy legs. But energy and power are, like, separated by time. 
or a factor of time. Yeah, because power is energy per second. But uh, anyway, that's it for this part. In the next part, we'll go north. <laughs> See ya!